Let's start by installing the High Definition Render Pipeline into our project. Open the Unity Package Manager, search for HDRP, and install it. This will allow us to use HDRP-compatible shaders, lighting, and other advanced rendering features. Once HDRP is installed, we'll need to configure our project. Go to Window, Rendering, and HDRP Wizard. Click the Fix All button to configure your project automatically. HDRP is now active, but you may notice that some materials or effects appear broken. Don't worry, this is normal and expected behavior when using a different render pipeline. Just enter the play mode to trigger RCCP's converter tool, or you can just open the RCCP toolbox and navigate to the Convert Tool tab. Simply start from step 1 to step 5, one by one. The converter will process all supported materials, shaders, and visual effects. It removes built-in shaders and replaces them with HDRP-compatible versions included in RCCP. This ensures that everything from lighting to car shaders work correctly, and all visuals are fixed. As you can see, the pink or broken materials are now fixed. HDRP lights, reflections, and effects are working properly. Realistic Car Controller Pro supports all major render pipelines, and this converter makes switching seamless. Thanks for watching. Check the documentation for more tips.